No one Hudgens, I don't know you, I've never seen you in my life. Uh, Tony Brad told me that you said that you have a YouTube, that I told you that Tony Brad wouldn't fight you. I would never chat new in my life, Tony. Uh, uh, what's his name? No. I never chat new in my life, no. You said the other day, or what's the other name? Marshall. Marshall said to me on the phone that you would not fight. Tony Brad. When I asked him to fight Tony Brad today, he said no. Right? Now, are you willing to fight this one? Right, listen, when I'm ready, I go with this man here. This man knocks at the door, I'd be out the road with you. We won't fight temporarily because you know the gas, why the gas is over now. What we do, when I'm ready, I come, I give you a couple of days' notice. I won't have on you straight away like you done to me when my brother was dead. I call now dead name. Let the dead out, lads. Listen, this is a fair man here. He can't be any straight or any fair. I'm going to walk down the name of this man, and if you are known, listen, let the dead rest, let my brother rest. That's all I want you to do. Don't be calling down single children names. There's another thing that's telling you here now, boys, right? I don't know if you are or not, but if you are at it, you're going to be ashamed of yourself, and you're working for Satan. There's only Satan comes out the words that I hear you coming out with. He's out the road with the land the other day, and he hung himself. My brother went along and hung himself. Their nerves wasn't at them. If they were, if they were normal, they wouldn't do anything like that. No one should call them names. We all have some belong to us down the years that sit belong to us. You're calling, you're supposed to be calling the down children, the down syndrome children names. I don't know if you had or not, but if you are at it, give it up. And, and if you want to fight Tony Brass, yes. any time when he's ready, give me a phone call and I'll show you where to hit you. Yes. And the true job. And here's another thing. Tony telling me this. You're supposed to go all along the other day and throw a pet in the bum at old man's house. An old man 70 years of age. Now we have that career and that's that's ridiculous. Mm. And Joe, the truth. When Noel Hutchins or whoever he was on that phone, when you asked him to fight me that day, would he fight me? He said he wouldn't fight you that day. Now the truth. But I don't know was it Noel or was it was What's your name? Ricky Mouse. Nah, Ricky Mouse. I don't know which one it is. Ricky, there's a fight here for you. There's a fight for our He's one. You know he is. Twiggy know who he is. He's a fellow who fought near side one time. He's the vice coming with me. He's a brother of mine. You know him. I won't mention his name. My brother Mikey is on as well. He's there for you. He's Martin. We'll have you. The three boys will have you that day. When I go to Joe Jai, when I'm ready, I knock at Joe, Joe knock at your door, and we go out the road. We won't have it in temporary. We'll have it in this county here. Because we'll keep the temporary guys out. Now, but here's another thing. I don't know you have or not, right? Tony telling me you're right, right? If you are cursing the dead, if my dead mother never is pleased by Give it. up that mission, right? If you are cursing the down children, children, calling names, give up that mission. That's the work of Satan. That's not the work of a right human being. That's a man that's fighting on his life. So if you're going to fight, whenever, whenever Tony is ready, Tony give me a shout. Yes. And I get your number off someone and I give you a shout. Yes. Listen. And if you get fair play, you get the one fair play Tony again. No one's going to be fouled. No one, I never fouled a man in my life. No. My, if one of my brothers was fighting tomorrow morning, one of my sons fighting, but a black man, I'd give the black man the one fair place and give your own son. That's me. That's me as I've been all my life. Mm. And listen, please let my brother rest. He's only dead, he was only 35 years old. Let my brother rest. That's all I'm saying to you, lads. There's a man that's fighting since he was 17 years of age, and you wouldn't see that man in Canada, by the way, here, Canada. And no. who would you ever fight in your life in the name of God? Who did you ever fight in your life, no? To come out and try to challenge people to fight? There's a fight man then you want in Canada. Well, I'm right, Listen, I don't look, know. it's like this now. We have no more to say. When I'm ready, no, I, this man is going to knock at your door. You're going to be put in the back of his car. If you think he's not going to show you a fair play, you go away and get your fair play, man. I'll be going to him in the back of the car. Both of us run away. And we drive down the back then. A way out of temporary. And the best man walk up to the end. Win, lose, or draw. I'm going down the name of the door. I'm not letting you off of for the names of the family, with the last 12 months on, on the what last What names are calling the people that you're telling me? Tell what they're calling the people. Tell the order that. Listen, my brother Richard has a child, he's Down syndrome. My, rich, my brother Richard and Miss Fletcher have committed to for that bad. Let the child be what he is. Just try to not have to open surgery in, in Dublin. Let the child's name on your mouth. And another thing, stop calling my mother, the man say my mother above the grave about cancer and this and that and that one. And my brother Christopher, the man can say that We'll sort that out when we go down the lane. He's the man that's bringing me down the lane. 
If you want, you show ball on fair play. If you don't think he's not going to show you fair play, he go away. You will send him there, you want England to get a man to show you fair play. Look. They can go to Russia, they can go to any press anywhere in England, any name in Ireland that you want to get fair play. And me and my boys will show this man here fair play. That's how it's going. How's it going to be done? Four with, four with you and four with him. Out the road. Out the road. Anybody, England or Ireland, you get. Do I do well, sick you now, and sick you now, Hutchins, calling the sick children names, calling the whole by the home set names, give up that mission. Mm. I'm telling you now. Stop, this, is, this is it now. We have no more to say it to me. When I'm ready, I'll give you a knock. I'll knock at Joe's door, I'll say, Joe, I'm ready. I'm not going to jump you like you the way you jumped on me. Wait till my brother's on the clear. Now, two or three days in the clear when didn't he start coming under comments? We get a little, uh, the man can say this and the man can say that. It'll be all over when we meet the name. When George, I'll show me fair play. That's it. I've no more to say. Till we meet. I, I won't do what you've done to me when I was heavy on the drinking, this and that, that are. I'm after it now. Listen, from today on, I'm getting myself ready, so I'm not going to give you no excuses. You get yourself ready. You are ready, 100% fit. No point saying or not. Because you're jogging with the last 20 years on our career, you never had a fight. But it's not that. This man has come with me to show me the highest player. I don't care if you bring up an England arm of Scotland. You told me last time that you're coming. And you did say. Get it out! Get it out! Go around his man, England or Ireland! Listen. I am the greatest man to ever put him up. Now listen to me. Listen carefully. You said the other day you weren't ready. You were waiting for a man to come back to show you how to play. I didn't get George to show me how to play. No, how fair can I be? Man. That's it. Goodbye, no more to say. Yeah, listen to me, and uh, listen to me. You were saying this morning about the way by Riley, was it? About the fact my uncle is Vinny. Yeah, that. that yeah. His brother, Jerry, wants to fight Patrick. My uncle is Patrick. Tell him I know how to fight Millie now. Tell Peter Riley, want to fight my two young yeah? Jerry and William, we want to fight Vinny and Jerry wants to fight Patrick, that's fair enough. Oh, Charlie Riley from Kilo wants to fight him already. <coughs> yeah, and he's. One loudspeaker. Right now. And he's your. Charlie Riley's your for the Jerry. I can't hear you, so the wind there. Charlie Riley's your for Jerry, he wants to fight Jerry. Charlie Riley's your for Jerry, he wants to fight Jerry. Can't hear the wind there, can't hear the fucking wind. Charlie Riley's your for Jerry. Charlie Riley's your for Jerry. All right, yeah. And me. Yeah, I'm going to fight Ricky. I'm going to Ricky, yeah? And we have Cappy's son, we have Cappy's son over at Old Dublin. Mountain, New Mountain. Yeah. Let's fight Steve. Let's fight Steve. Yeah. Listen, Mikey, you want to fight Mikey, you want to fight Chewie's mouth. Yeah. Yeah. I can hear you now, yeah? You need to get a stool for Mikey. Yeah. And me and Tony. Yeah. Go slow, I want to fight Ricky. I want to fight Ricky. Yeah, and me and Tony, yeah? And Michael Haney. Michael Haney, where's the thing? Michael Haney, should we go to Michael Haney? Yeah, I'm here for Michael Haney. I've been here, like, do you know what I mean? I'm here for Michael Haney. I'm here for Michael Haney. Where's the thing? Michael Haney, listen, Michael Haney. That's fair enough, so. Right, so. Right, you and Tony, right? You and Tony, right? You and Tony, right? Yeah. Listen, listen, listen. Me and Martin Cassie. There's me and Tony, yeah? You and Tony, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and you're trying to raise your for that Jerry, is it? No, I'm trying to raise your for Jerry, yeah. You want to fight Jerry, yeah? That'll do, yeah. And close. Peter, I need two sons. Will you buy one? Yeah. Jerry, will you want to fight your two sons? That'll do, yeah. And close. Rabbi wants to fight. Mikey wants to fight who? Ricky. No, Rabbi fight Ricky. Yeah. Rabbi fight Ricky. Yeah. And me and Martin Carty. Martin Carty. Martin Carty and Stephen, is it? Martin, Martin, Martin Carty and Stephen. That's no problem. That'll do so. That's 100% done. Listen, Martin Carty, 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 Martin Yeah, but listen to me, we're putting up an old DVD now, right? No name calling or nothing like that, right? And listen to me, this is the last DVD we're putting up. No, tell him he's recorded, right? he's recorded, he's recorded. Now listen, Richard. <laughs> no, no.
Now this is the thing. Yeah, but this to me. Now this to me. There's none of my there's none of my boys here writing up any comments right under these videos. So I hope there's none of yours writing up dirty comments there. Tell him he's video now. Yeah? Tell him. No. Will you tell the man he's video now? Right, listen to me, that'll do so, listen to me, we're back on the DVD now, right? Tell me this video now. Right, and I'm... Yeah, yeah we got ready, yeah? Yeah, and the two... <coughs> Richard, this is Eddie Hare, Joe, can I, that's okay, Richard, I'll accept Charlie Riley's ch challenge when to fight me. And my own fella, that, that'll be... Yeah, 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 yes, yes, there's nobody just thinking of carrying out and carrying out. I'll, uh... So, Charlie... Yeah. Who do you want to play with that? Now, listen, Richard, did Charlie Riley challenge me, then he did. <laughs> Well, you tell Charlie Riley I'll be there on that road. If he doesn't show up on the road, I'll call to Charlie Riley myself and I'll pull him out of his house and he's going to fight me and that's the end of it. Eddie, ask him if he wants to Is there anyone Eddie. Pudgy? Now, Pudgy, Pudgy wants to know. Eddie. That'll do, Richard. Eddie. That'll do. I'll take a word in there. That'll do. Um, Eddie, will you just Pudgy wants to know is there anyone there for him? Just tell him that he's been videoed now at one time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get it all over and done with. Now, yeah. that's it. That's it. That is, that is it, Richard. Let, let everyone get down with their business then. Make sure that that's why it won't stand. No, I was going to watch the video. I was going to call any dead people in there, Richard. Like, you know, Eddie, like, Eddie, look, Eddie, look, Eddie, look, Eddie, look, Eddie, Eddie, you've not said no. The fight is out. God. No, no. no. The dead should be let rest. The dead should be let rest. Mm. No one called the dead names tonight. Oh, Richard, Richard, I do want to say one thing, Richard. I, I do want to say one Yes, yes. Now, another thing, Richard, whoever's going around saying that we're calling your, your children names, that was, that's all lies. We never called any children names. Now, did, I ever, did we ever come in and call your children names? There you go, Richard. Look, I want to put you back here to know yeah. Go on, sorry, Richard. <laughs> right, Richard, listen to me. What we're doing now is putting an old DVD in there, right? And then they challenge all the fight. Challenge, take up challenges. Tell listen to me. me. Before I go, right, my young fellow here, Vinny, wants to have a word you there. Don't put that video. I know, Richard. Richard. Will you buy command there? Challenge me, didn't he? He said I wasn't man enough to command the video. That's no problem, Richard. Look, Richard, I'm here on the phone now looking at this video camera now. You're being video camera now. I challenge Willie. He challenged me. I accept his challenge. Do tell him to be there on the day because I'm going to be there. That's it now. No more. Hang on. Right, sorry. Richard, this, this is Huey's mic Michael here. You said last night that my father was an easy target out in Shinron, didn't you? Did you on the phone last night? You said my father was an easy target out in Shinron. But I'm going to say, no, no, let, no, Richard, let me, no, let me talk. Michael, let me talk. Let me talk. Let me talk. I'm going to say here to you and to anyone that wants to take your take your side, that's going to be your downfall if you take my father's nature target on the channel. No, that's it. I talked to George Ice on the phone and he gave me um, Tony's number. Give me your number, Tony. I rang you, Tony. You said that you want to fight Noel. He said, get Noel, get back to this. No, no, we'll give you there. That's no problem. No, we'll yeah? And you said that Mikey wants to fight me. That's no problem. I'll fight Mikey. He said, Unless it's no better rabble, 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 no balls. And you said you had a burden on there for Stephen. So I asked you, was it Michael Daly? You said to me, Michael Daly's not fighting Stephen, he's afraid to fight Stephen. And you said you're burning on Martin Carter to fight Stephen. Steve, I'll be there on the road for Martin Carter, don't worry. Me and you have a Martin Carter. And I'll be there for uh, the Fort of Belly, Rabbi, the big head. Him or anybody, if you're afraid to come out and fight me, anyone else there, Ronnie, be come out and fight me. I'll be there for any Now, guys, we're, any all, we're also, also have it on the phone here as well. We have another video on the phone here as well. Where Richard was on the phone, set up the fights, ready and the rest of the guys there. Right, lads. Richard went on the phone there, Charlie, saying that you wanted to fight me on the 2nd of April. Charlie. I've, that's Charlie right now. Well, Charlie, I have no doubt that Richard has said that as you said it. So I'll fight you on the 2nd of April. My son, you said you, you want your son to fight my son. My son will be there as well on the 2nd of April. If you're not on the road on that day, I claim victory. But victory is no good to me without me and you being face to face. If you're not on that road that day, Charlie, I'm coming to your house. One way or another, me and you're going to fight now. No name calling, no nothing. They're out there dead, all the lads. 
They have everything. I explained there to Richard on the phone a minute ago, I'm recording put up on YouTube. We call none of the children names if I agreed with me. So that's the end of it. Look up about your name card. There's none of that. We'll just have our own fight slides. Look at There's none of us fighting, man. But we'll have a few slaps. Right, have yeah, right, let, that be, let that be the end of it. Let the better name walk. No, we knock you out the couple of slaps. No, no, look at none of that. There no, is that. Look there is that. My part. I do it anyway. I do it. Look at no name card over there. Right, like that. Listen to me. Tony, you tell me. It's fair enough, Tony. I accept your challenge. It's not wrong. You said you weren't ready. I understand that your brother died and all this crap. No man will If you keep it up, you'll be giant. Yeah, Tony, I wish that, will you? Right, Tony, one, two more, Tony, accept that's fine, Tony. I understand that. Any man will be able to time. I'm going four more, that's no problem. Right, there's a few more things I'll sort out first, lads. Number one, lads, Joe Joyce, we actually did a late show, fair play. I can actually, nephew man, actually, and you agree to that. Right, young Joe, yeah. And young Joe said, ran Ricky, or one round or anywhere, he said, Tony said he wouldn't fight, that he had to get better out. Right, that's fair enough. Then a few days before, 12, you, old Joe, you rang my nephew and he said that the practice was on the phone that night, they were drinking, they said they wanted to fight. So next, next morning they're supposed to ring again and said there was no fight. So you said to my nephew, I don't think they're the full children, they won't fight. Now listen to that, and then he came into YouTube the other day, with the Prats, right, and it, there's different stories completely. He's saying that one of us, you weren't sure about yourself, I was a Ricky, you were talking on the phone and you asked, we fight Tony Pratt. Number one, Joe, I wasn't talking to him tonight. No phone, no anywhere. So you weren't talking to me. Whoever you're talking to, you weren't talking to me. Because if you ask me to fight Tony, you know. I'd definitely fight any of the right? I'd say any of So listen to me. No fair play, man, that's right. Switch the sides. Or no fair play, man takes any, any sides or compliments on any sides. A fair play man is there to show fair play on both sides and that got thrown by the other side. So tell me what we do, Joe. You show them fair play. I'll, I'll have our man. Now listen to that. Tony, you said that I, I said that last time I got a man down from England to show fair play. I didn't say that. I said a man come from England. I said that must show fair play. Joe, you said I don't care if you come from Russia. Listen, listen to that. We don't have to go to Russia, England, anywhere. We can get plenty of money to show fair play. And they're saying fighting in George ICR. There's no such thing in George ICR no, or, or any year. Or any year, right? That's a carry's good enough. The two fair play men, we sort out that ourselves, right? Now listen, we don't care that you fight in the middle of a town that's in the square with the whole nation watching, watching it, right? We don't care. I want to go to the, to the bottom of Wicklow Mountains. That's so goes there, we don't care. But no, it's not a one minute street here, that. So don't be taking all the orders and giving all the orders. Another thing, Joe, you came down YouTube saying, uh, I'm your warning, who's this, that, that, Now listen to me, listen to me, very careful, that. We're making a more video, that, so I'm going to say this once. We don't take orders, that's the no man. We're fighting, the, the, this fight's going on between Hudson the Prats and the Rileys, right? And a few of the Harties. Right? They're the minute we're fighting mud. So we're not involved with nobody unless people want to get involved themselves. That's fine by us if, if they do. But look, lads, don't be coming on YouTube, lads, and saying you're warning us this that because we don't take a warning from nobody. There's no man in the whole universe that we take an order from. Right? We don't take any orders, lads. Uh, Richard, you you were on the phone to me this morning, this means when you said that Willie Mike Riley wants to fight because the video is there now. Willie, you challenge me saying I want some man to come on the video and accept your challenge. I accept your challenge. I'll be there on the day and you better be there on the day. And also Willie Mike I don't know how to tell you, other brothers, what, Jerry is it? What's that? Jerry, yeah. Jerry, you're Jerry. Richard said that he wants to fight my only for Patrick. No, that's no bother, just stand here. Look, I'm there for Jerry. Anyways. That's no bother. Now listen, lad, see, that's how it works, lad, right? Every man here accepts all your challenges, right? Whatever challenge you put up for, we accept every one of them, right? Any man, our side, your side, doesn't show up on the day, right, is only an asshole and lose their fight, okay? Now, no name calling up like that, lad. If you don't come out, Rabbi, to me, you're a holy show in the whole world. Like, everyone already knows that you're afraid of me, right? That you won't come out. If you come out anywhere less, they'll be getting through, bangs at you. Michael, I go easy on you if you come out. Michael Nelly, I'm challenging you to fight on the 2nd of April. If you want to be there, be there. I'll be on the road on the 2nd of April. And we'll, we'll if Rabbi won't take me challenge, but I need, I need the rest of them over there to grow a pair of balls and challenge me, will they? We'll be there on the 2nd of, uh, of April for those fights. So and if he's sprat rats, come to me. Yeah, I don't know, know why. Right, that's 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 you are copying every word I said two weeks ago. No, no, nobody. Because that's what you are. You are nobody. You're the scum of the earth. The like of you to go along calling handicapped children names belong to these people here, the sick children, the Pratt. Call them out there, brother, the homicide names. You're the scum of the earth. You don't talk about the day and you don't call sick children names. Now, I didn't know I was being there this evening, right? Hoping I get you walking the street. So come up behind you and tuck the face in you, let them. I'll make you know, get down on your knees and beg mercy when I get you in the right spot. Trust me. And I'll really do it with that. And another thing, your bear or banner of fear never to go against it. 
You're bare and old bullish. Any fear and errant, I'll be at them. I'll get me daughters to be a chief. I wouldn't get me sons, because I got the greatest sons in Ireland to fight. They're up with them all them top class men in Ireland to fight. My boys, you're not in the scum. When did they ever come to have a fighting man belong to you? When did you have a man, a million man belong to you? I want a fighting man. You scum of the year. Grew up. Now listen, you'll be looking over your shoulders till the day I get you. And if I don't get you, my, my sons will. Now hang on. I was son John nearly 40 years of age. And he'll tie his hand behind his back. And he'll beat the best of ye one after another. He scumbags ye. Now, another thing. Three weeks ago, Tony brought this man here. Was on the phone to me. He said, I actually said an old husband when he boxed me the day. I rung up. Now, I don't know, I don't know I'm telling lies. I don't know, no, but the dude was on the phone to me. But he was a Hutchinson's. But you were there. He said, no, he said, I'm not fighting. Now, listen. I said to you to you, when I looked at our tape you made, you're only shit talking in it, right? I said to you, Noel, will you fight Tony Brad Sunda? Do you want to turn around and said, no. Now listen to this. I the left, victory. Listen. He is victory. Hey, listen. Tony Pratt is victory. I Be it for you. Now listen to this. The last thing I made me a tape about you, I was more or less trying to give you a good advice. Stop calling out sick children names. Stop calling me those dead brothers of home self names. We all had people that went, went to hide the of the home self. He lost his mind. There's loads of poor people in line that lost people like that because they lost them with their heads. They want them right to stay in mind. So you should let them rest. But Tony, not Tony, no one, when I get you, I'm going to make a big, big mercy. You're good for nothing, scumbag, you. And I claim a victory to the George I put my hand up. Now listen, there's another thing. I forgot to say this to you, but I'll have to say it now to you. The last thing I would do a bit of jive with you, we can get men from Russia. You can get any men in Ireland to get you. The men we belong to us are the best fighting men in Ireland. They're up there with all the good men. And look at all the good men that I know in Ireland. Paddy Wards people, the Wards. The Nevins, the Queen McDonald's, they're not fighting me. The McDonald's good fighting me. Where did that Hutchins ever come to be a man? All you are is name callers. You scumbag you. You're bad of every fear in Ireland. Trust me, I'm getting me girls to be at you. And when you stand back looking at you like that, I say get my bait and off my daughters. And I'm going to get a 15 year old boy to give you a bait. Come to my heart, Phil! Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, watch up, watch up! Listen! There's only a small little man! Tell us to do the many hooks in this fight! Oh, if we had it, if we had it, what's the fight I'd fight? So there's not one whole dirt I'd fight, I'd throw this man here in a perfect job. Simple as that. That's gravity, Jay! We have me belong to I have never belonged to me, the best fight for me to ever have a court to fight! We were bred to fight! But gee! You scumbags! And when he dies, he's gonna hand over his cap to me. You can't have it now! Three. Yeah! 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 Get up! Get up! You scumbags! Get up! You scumbags! Get up, he's gone. He starts this one, we didn't start it. We want no trouble at no one, we never look for trouble. But you are the ones that's night and day with bits of top screen inside and with the bags hanging behind you. There's a man, I was willing, I'm standing at the back of Scumbags all day in North Korea. So I can wait. Me and this man and his sons, Wake G, and I want you to show up. Only Gareth has something down every minute. Ross Gray, you're, right living, you're living fine close to We me. mentioned it in Skippies and Dippies in pub. When we, we, we see in the pub, we walk in the door. Well, he is a man. Twice is a class in you know the fight. And you wouldn't the fight. Day, you turn around and you say, I won't fight, I'll fight in the air. And the right, and another thing. The last time, I oh, won't. You don't be scumbag, you. You're scumbag, you. And oh, the, listen to this. You wouldn't find a man. I have Hutchinson's cousins, don't you forget. He seems to be nice, but he's in the form, me anyways, right? I'll take Hutchinson's boys. Dear, you want to try and walk them into trouble as well. They're my cousins. But you, Q. But, but you, you you're, you're with their boys. He's talking about Tim's boys. But Chewy, you're with their boys in, in Ashbury. The minute we were standing out there waiting for him, and his two sons, and we drowned away waiting for him. Now, why don't you show up? And listen to me, Noel. 
I claim victory. You're bet. You I asked you twice. There's a man that should fight. The 61 year old wouldn't fight him. Listen, if ever ever you have a man that'll fight, give me a phone call. Give me a phone call. A phone call. Listen, it's all over now. Oh, look, you're looking on Facebook. Tell you one thing, lads. You look serious, spin over there. George, you come here, one, Joe, you old fool. Listen to me. Perhaps up in the yard. Listen, Joe. Listen to me. You said you came the whole way. You're angry today at 3 o'clock. You said, my son, Joe. You'll be there in 45 minutes. I tell you one thing. What happened? You lose the road. And then you're you up there now saying you were down a supermax waiting for us. You feed your belly. A supermax is not even a quarter mile from that very side, if anyone knows it. And you had, you're supposed to be fighting and going all over the fucking world to fight And you had, to it, you had the bollocks to come from Supermax up to here. Oh, by the way, lads, this goes for anyone around, right? If any man knows Supermax in Rasgrave, they're in Rasgrave, look at Supermax, but look beside it, the guards barrack. Is that kind of fight in the air? Tony Pratt, you're dirty. Joe, you're heading up to it to eat fucking Tony's You hand. tell me, Joe, on the phone, you said that Tony Pratt and Jimmy said they're not the full shit in. They're saying when they're drinking at the fight and when they're sober in the same, they won't. You ask me where they're the full shit in. You're a roguish bastard, you Joe. Uh, yeah? Hey, Gibson, boys, Joe, how much did they give you? How much did they give you now? A long lick in there. Tony, you can't be up there and you're not watch shit for licking out Joe's arm. Yeah. Listen to me, boys. Listen to me now very carefully. You won't come to our side if you, we're, we're waiting. We're, we're ringing you four or five heads a day, but you won't. No, you wouldn't come. You wouldn't come. Do you know about it? You wouldn't come. Hold on. Whoa. We're ready for you anyway. Whoa. Listen, lad. We're inviting you over. We dare you over. Whoa. You know what we have with you, buddy. Don't you? You know what we have with your name on it, boys. And we're inviting you, dare you over. Joe, Please, come. I dare you. Come. I dare you. You don't have to. I dare you. You don't, you don't hold the fucking retire. It's about time now that someone forced you to retire. And you're like, come here. If your daughter was that good, then why did you send him out? If your son John was that good, why do you do better than you when Barry and beginning with the face off? Pop the hell out. I went, you, you, you. When the pressure came on you, you bit down man's ear. Then they lost your tone. What happened to your tone with the end beginning? Put down your neck. He might never be like that. Yeah, fucking Tony. You said that, you said that they were waiting for here in Australia for me and see on my own for that. That's bullshit. Because you know that we fight you. Because we, we, we came today now and we bet the balls on you. Tony, we bet the balls on you. We fight for you. We want to be that road that day. Yeah. Where are you, You're frankly bastard. You're frankly bastard. I tell you, fight hand, don't fight me, you bastard. Right, right this goes for a bit. I ain't the part. I ain't the ladies. I ain't the character. Right, but you're disgusting. What the fuck's with none of you? Lad, you said you were down there. We went down. Where were you hiding there? You're down feeding your belly, you must have been. You were hiding in good place, boys. We passed down the other sinner there. Two swat cards off in America, all right? Oh, no, we, have, we have one cousin, and yeah, listen to me. one cousin in Limerick, oh, and he has to be bet to death that you're that afraid of him that he can't fuck up. If your boy's you're, you're, you're not so good at fighting, why don't you, Joe, go back and fight you, Mike and Levin? The boy, you're going to be the fight, man, there. You're hitting the boy each time in the break you are, yeah? You're fouling the boy to death you are. Uh, didn't the boy barely tap you with your head, you stopped the fight. You're not good at fight, man. Why the hell him carry on with fights? And plus, the boy after that is begging you. He's crying out in the phone for you to fight. You won't fight him, would you? No, you're trying to switch fights. You wouldn't fight him. Listen, that's, that's, you know where from. That's, come here, you? Everyone knows. I had to choose one. You put that one. Oh, everyone knows that the fight was that for the tw by second. We didn't make that arrangement, left. You, Joe Joyce, and Tony, she, Tony Pratt, came and met that. Come to Hulls! Come to Hulls! You'll never get out of it! You'll never get out of it! Listen, listen, hold on. You, you said the second, right? And then you talked to, to jump his day and was a good few of you, right? A couple of us, right? Before the second came up. But you know what's going to happen now, lads? There's no single fair fight because you're not entitled to it. And another thing, we Tony, won't get scared Tony, of anyone. Listen to me, Tony Pratt, right? With the gummy mouth. Listen to me. This goes for anyone to me. You, you're living in, and you're bragging on George Joyce helping me. He's not helping me at all, boy. Don't, 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 don't you need that son of right? You got them at the trouble. You That's all. Yeah, and you, Joe. You're going to get it, Joe. The first place you are, any of your sons, any of your getting it, boys. You're getting it. You hear me? And, brain damage, okay? And, and you know what we're talking about, don't you? Every one of you, brain damage, you dirty, shitty bastards. We're not talking about this, boy. You don't deserve it like that. that. You don't deserve it like that. You yeah. know what we're talking about. Is that your way now of backing out of fights? Is it getting another kid to do your fighting team? But that's no good to hold. If you're the main one, no, because listen for a second now. We we challenge you, right? I told you guys to that fight. That's no problem. I made a video saying that fight. But now you're saying here, so that's the end of it. We wouldn't be here for the moment. We'll box and we know we'll box. We are a good breed. Listen to me, lads. Listen to me. There's no things I'm good, good or bad. Right? Listen we to me. are a good breed. Right. Every man is there to do the wrong thing. But listen to me. You're looking for a fair fight first, right? And on the fair fight, he, he made agreement. That's, that's not the whole world. The second of April, right? And then we all agreed to that. And now he's had to jump a few of us lads when he got a crowd of you together. That's not happening. I suppose to come to Raspberry Day, right? Yes. Fight me. And then wouldn't come up to our side. We dare you, couple of We've been to the day. Come here. Do you know what we have waiting for? We ring you four or five times, you shits. No. We ring you four or five times, tell you the compass. You wouldn't come because you know what's going to happen. You know what's going to happen. You'll never get out of it. You'll never get out of it, you boy. And no, trust me, no, I keep no, it up. No one's not supposed to go to any fear. We'll go to any fear in this right. country. No one's not. Warm your line, Joe. I know it's a big pot belly you have. Next is Joe, you think you can't be Joe. Get out of the way. Don't want to put scared those pracks. Get who you like. Don't want to You're at life to our door. If you take them in, you will not get out of it. Come to our door. Our door. Anything. Anything. You shitty, dirty, r
it seems to me You're not going to go pull Jace. We were prepared to go by their mind It seems to me We don't, don't, don't scare by We let's be We go to any fair No one's scared wasn't that thing It seems to me lads right That you're in love yourself You're thinking in Hollywood By making these films Make all the fucking yucks you want We're making one That's going straight to your heart That you tell you We don't give a fuck about you right We never did We never Joe listen to me You never aired in our respect by that When we do that cards from the likes of you We're daring you We're daring you to come to our side Do you know what's going to happen If you're mean come here You know we're waiting for you my daughter we're not talking about we're not talking about that. You know we're, we're waiting for you, fucking cunt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on, boy. You're big. We're picking your idea, boy. What's wrong with you? You're afraid. Why well, count the price? All right. I'll join them. Will you go up here, boss, and come to us? Will you? You fucking shits. Nobody. Blowing yourself up. You're this. You're that. You the All you want to give you the name was your said. Yes. You're the You're up for that. Fuck you. And Joe, you're saying there. You give yourself the own name. Your own name. Mr. Words your mouth. Your mouth, you bet. Listen to me, Jay. Listen to me. We don't go around talking about people hanging ourselves, right? We all into that fucking pain, so we can't talk about anyone hanging ourselves. We didn't talk about children. If you weren't deaf, you would have heard Richard admit the other day. Now listen to me. There's no more fair fights just than that and other, right? And don't go around saying the poor people in Ireland. Since when did you give a fuck about right, people in Ireland? Right, guys, now listen to me, come here, you know what we have here for you. Right, yeah, come on, guys, I listen, think you please, please come. come. Go easy on you. Listen, here it goes now, here it goes now, right? That showed, come on, guys. That goes now, show that the cars are genuine, 100% fine. You need to do the fight. Yup, 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 I was talking to you, I was talking to you, you little young John. You told me that your father was meant to be a straight man. You said he doesn't like anyone telling stories and lies that he wouldn't have that old crack. And he was. That's why I wouldn't get to a fair play. You're already a rogue here. Go ahead, back. Tell me. Advice. Cracks, listen to me. How much did that set you back? Yeah, well. Some fair man, man, you were. I couldn't have a snatch up. Oh, Jerry, 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 oh, you can put up a hundred videos, say what you want. If you don't see who's applying, lads, let no man get it wrong. They were afraid of that. The only reason why I'm here is because of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah,